Can't believe it. Sheldon loves telling on people when they break the rules. Yeah, well, maybe he's changed. He hasn't changed. Last week when the vending machine gave me two bags of chips, he called my mom. <laughs> well, that didn't ruin your life. Well, it ruined my day. I had to talk to my mom. <laughs> who, by the way, is, is polyamorous now. So, it's fun to think about. <laughs> of Sheldon and Amy, you know? They want to win this thing on their own merits, not by knocking out the competition. Yeah, but what if they don't win? Uh, Pemberton and Campbell have done an amazing job of associating their names with super asymmetry. They have all the momentum right now. Look, I don't like the idea of them losing either, but this is their decision to make, not ours. <sighs> Maybe it is ours. What do you mean? Well, if Sheldon and Amy don't want to expose Pemberton, that doesn't mean someone else can't do it for them. They'd never have to know. Really? You'd do that? They deserve the Nobel. I'm not going to let two frauds steal it from them. And if that means getting my hands dirty, so be it. <laughs> it's so funny. Realize I've never actually seen your hands dirty. <laughs> all right, Hofstetter. Here's all the proof you need. Great, thanks. Just remember, once you take this envelope, there's no turning back. What if I look at it and decide not to use it? I had not considered that. <laughs> gotta hand it to you, you got a real talent for making things boring. Thanks. Hey, look at that, you did it again. Hi, Leonard. What, nothing. You okay? Uh, no, you are. 